Hello everyone, and this is my weekend preview for the week starting on June 22nd, 2015. Obviously, before going into what's going to happen this week on the channel, uh, let's go into what happened last week. Uh, honestly, it was kind of a slow week. It was kind of a slow week in the terms of what I decided to produce for the channel, and that was just kind of because I was uh, more focused in on uh, on my job and everything in that sense, and doing other. Uh, other things in general. So I didn't get that much done in, uh, in the end. Obviously I did my typical wrestling reviews and my Call of Duty set on Sunday uh, and that was uh, you know the basics of what I really went for. I got a couple other things in there and I'll get into those in a moment. What I did over on the Twitch channel not too much. I got one stream in, a fairly long stream throughout the day of uh, me and a buddy of mine, Daniel, uh, who we are, we've been practicing Dead or Alive in a lot of other fighting games. And when he had come over and we did some casuals over on the Twitch channel for uh, Dead or Alive 5 last round and for uh, Ultra Street Fighter 4. And, you know, like I said, relatively long sets, uh, probably about three and a half, four hours. It, it, it was a good... Uh, chunk of time that we spent on both uh, on both those games about three or four hours total in, in the end uh, so that was pretty much all we got over on the twitch channel which was about uh, was on uh, Thursday evening um, I had been also going to uh, a gaming place that I've been uh, that we I've usually frequented a lot uh, over the past year, year and a half, uh, the gaming zone out here in Arizona, and we were, you know, doing uh, KI practice, Street Fire practice. Everybody's kind of, everybody in the area is kind of getting ready for uh, for Evo and going out there, uh, out to Vegas this year. So we've obviously been doing a lot of live casuals, things like that, stuff that I necessarily did not get a chance to record or did not want to record or anything in that sense. Um, uh, so, in the end, not too much was really going on with the channel. I did get a couple other streams going on with the channel this week because, uh, honestly, I had been doing a lot of fighting games and the only shooter I had been really doing in, the, in that sense had been Call of Duty. So, I wanted to get a couple of those other ones in uh, that, I typically that I typically play when I get a chance. Uh, and so, I went ahead and had a Halo Master Chief Collection set where I was playing multiple different playlists uh, where I had a chance to play some, game, uh, some games inside of Halo 3, some games in Halo 2, some games in Halo 1 in, in that, uh, within those playlists. And uh, again, a lot of fun. I, the one thing I liked about Master Chief Collection was, a, was the aspect of being able to play on uh, all four of the main Halo games and playing all the maps as well. Uh, it was just unfortunate when the game initially came out, it was, well, pretty much broken it, in the terms of it's online. Uh, you couldn't really find matches that much, it was dropping out, it was making teams uneven, and you were pretty much stuck with that, and it, it made it, unfortunately, not as good as it could have been. It could have been probably one of the best things that they had ever pulled off. Did not uh, execute it well. They fixed a lot of the bugs within it, but uh, you know, a little too late in that sense. But a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun now, and that obviously is now a video on my um, on the YouTube channel as well. At this point, uh, I I forget which day it was, but like randomly, uh, I think it was a couple days after the actual uh, release of it. Uh, I got a co I got two codes on, on my Xbox One saying, "Hey, you're gonna be part of the uh, the Gears of War Ultimate Beta." I was like, "Okay." I've always real I've o like Gears has always been one of my favorite shooters uh, to play in general. So uh, decided uh, like just out of the blue when I got a chance, I think Friday morning or something like that, to do a stream on the YouTube channel, which I got in there probably about an hour 40 minutes or so uh, just a quick taste of what was going on I'm not sure when the beta is gonna end uh, so I'm gonna try to maybe get another one going again if I can uh, but I, because I've always loved I've always loved the gear series and uh, it was kind of like I said I never registered for the beta 
at least I didn't think I did. Maybe I did with uh, maybe playing the games in the past or something like that. That was how uh, I potentially got registered in there. So the fact that I got a code out of nowhere was um, kind of a kind of surprise, and I was extremely happy to go in and play and test out the servers with what they were doing at at this point in time. So all in all, in that sense, it was um, you know pretty much a week of shooters on the channel which is uh, a little bit weird I, I know the YouTube channel is mainly uh, for the YouTube channel is mainly for multiplayer so that goes m for shooting games it goes for fighting games it basically goes for any multiplayer that I decide that I want to play at that point uh, and pretty much that's where the twitch channel is kind of going right now at least or at least it's for a lot more of live casual play uh, when buddies are coming over to my place and we can just you know play games casually in some way shape or form uh, I'm hoping to get uh, maybe after the Evo Tim uh, Evo uh, event this year uh, uh, this year uh, or next month um, after being done with that maybe I can get some more single player uh, experiences into the game into my twitch channel and we'll you know try to progress that channel in some way shape or form it really hasn't gone too much and, I, uh, and that's admittedly because I haven't taken the time to do it uh, the other thing I ended up getting done with the YouTube channel was I was able to get my uh, a few weeks ago I made mention that I did a set of Uniel, uh the fighting game Uniel on um, on Twitch and I was gonna look to try to get that because it was the first time I was ever playing a game so I was actually learning it and uh, doing a few things here and there and then had a few matches with it um, I was going to look to try to get that set somehow over to the YouTube channel. I was able to do that. And it's obviously on this channel now. So that's basically what I did last week with the channel. It, uh, all in all, I did talk a lot about it. Uh, I talked a long time about everything, even though I didn't really do that much in the end. Uh, so this week, um, obviously I'm going to go with my typical where you're gonna get the raw review uh, that will probably happen later tonight uh, you'll get the uh, TNA impact review uh, WWE NXT review uh, the Call of Duty set on Sunday and I think this week if I find the time um, and th this is an aspect I'm trying to find the time to, uh, to do all this extra stuff in there because at the end of the week I've got, uh, we've got like a weekly tournament for Ultra Street Fighter 4, or basically a weekly practice where a bunch of us from the Arizona area are getting around practicing for EVO. I, go, I try to go to it every week uh, right now. And then the day, next day, I'm going to go back to that, uh, the same place, and we're going to have a Killer Instinct Mortal Kombat X and Dead or Alive 5 Last Round tournament. Uh, right at uh, the very next day so that's what I'll be doing over the weekend so I mainly might not be able to get much going with the uh, with the weekend times but we'll we'll see what we can get uh, I'll see what I can get going and if there's time for anything um, mainly what I want to do is try to get a set of games and basically using my main characters I'm gonna try to make it like a weekly type thing where uh, I'm playing them uh, because I'm character locked right now in the terms of playing these games. So I'm not going to be picking the new ca new characters or different characters for the time being. So like I'll be playing mainly Saber Wolf and uh, Killer Instinct because he's probably the one I know the best. I haven't really had too much success with any of the other characters. Uh, Chun Li and Ultra Street Fighter 4 again haven't had much success with any other characters in some way, shape, or form. And then again, I haven't really taken the time to play a lot of the different characters in some cases as well. I have had little minimal success, but nothing in the terms of you know uh, being able to do anything relatively uh, crazy good in any way, shape, or form. Um, or maybe like Kasumi and Bayman in Dead or Alive 5. That's where I'm probably going to go with those type of games. I might be able to get a set in with those in some way, shape, or form. Uh, that's what I'm looking to do. If I'm gonna, if I do get a chance, obviously I'll put it up. If I don't, uh, unfortunately I won't be able to do it. But you'll definitely get the guarantees this week. Uh, I might be doing another. Uh, Dead or Alive casual set on Thursday again on the Twitch channel. If I get another chance to do more 
uh, with a Twitch channel as well. It, it, uh, well, um, I'll try to figure out a way to. Was it not trying to figure out a way, but uh, just trying to find the time right now is kind of uh, the hard thing with trying to get other things done. Like I schedule out certain things, and then uh, if other things fall into place, they fall into place. If they don't, they don't. And you know, I try to find the time. Sometimes I get it. Sometimes I don't. Uh, and we'll see where everything goes. Uh, obviously, I do have a busy week in the terms of being out uh, um, out setting up and you know hanging out with a few friends every now and again obviously hanging out uh, and playing uh, playing games with uh, the guys who want to play Ultra Street Fire 4 and then the tournament on Saturday so we'll see what we can get done with everything uh, expect the Call of Duty set of course on Sunday and of course expect the wrestling reviews and that's basically what's gonna happen this week on the channel so uh, I hope you guys enjoy everything that comes up and I thank you guys for watching.